All right, so some, uh, some of my parts came in for power steering pump and um, I'm gonna be fixing the steam vent lines on the Trans Am. So I don't currently like the way they, they go. Looks very cheap. So, oh, this is the uh, set crossover piece for the exhaust. Right here. Make it a two and a half inch. So that was that came in. And I have dash eight. Do hard lines and then from the power steering as well. Um, all power steering with this uh, hybrid boost and the way my stuff is set up. Uh, it's not good enough. It's still, eh, I'm turning the wheel. So it's a dash six on it currently. I'm about to move to a dash, a dash eight, a dash, um, dash eight for the just the returns on the power steering side. So I have some uh, do some hard line. I have hard line right there. A bunch of it's dash eight. Make it a. 16th or a half inch line. And that's what the part I'm going to do on here. Let's get this around. Keep making it on. Sick. That's part of the power string I'm working on here. We'll come out dash eight on around and then it's going to go dash eight into, into here. The reservoir and then over to the power string. Uh, the, the uh, I don't know, power string box yeah. out. Go into the uh, the cooler and then go back into the the reservoir. God. This is just the parts there finally start coming in. I got all the parts except for I got one coming in tomorrow. And I'll be be ready to start fabbing that that part of the. Process up. These are uh, more hose clamps I got for the um, hot water. Hot water. The AC. It's a dash 12, the dash 10. It goes around in. I have four of these, or three of them come through here. And I'm going to start just to tie them all together. It's make it nice and neat for it's on hanging around the bouncing because all the exhaust is right right there. I bought it because it's black. Uh, the lines are going to be black. Probably hide it a little better, make it look a little more professional because I am not a professional. I just do this Try to figure shit out as I go along. Here's the uh, fourth one that I need for the half inch line or dash eight hard line. And this here is only need one of these, these T's, uh, the, the steam vent. Cause I have, I went down the hardware store, got some uh, brass ones. I think the, uh, these are stainless steel. It will look better when I put the hose on there. Looks so uh, trashy. These will be my 90s for the dash eight for the power steering. Oh, wow. I could find them in like a stainless steel look or aluminum look. So we're done with that. And. So that's gonna be for my uh, those two of them. I could, I could buy two of them for the same price as one. So I was like, you know, well, I'll get two. You never know. You never know. All right. So oh, here's my two fittings. They're gonna go into the power steering uh, cooler to adapt it to a dash eight. Both those. 
Those are also basically buy one, get one free on, on eBay. I can either buy one for like $13 or I could buy two of them for $13. No brainer. And this is going to be my the hose connections for the uh, steam vents. Got to make sure that fits. Um, otherwise, there'll be some more modifications. It does seem like a big old hose. Hose bar. Maybe I'll have to. Maybe I'll use these. Maybe I won't. So I just need to. And this is the last piece I need for the the hose. So the LS hose is like one one and a quarter. Yeah. Alright, so this is adapt the, the LS hose I have on the, the truck hose to the currently had a Pontiac hose on there. All right, and, there was, and there's a hole, hole in there that I want to use to adapt uh, the steam vent. This little guy. Face it where this is down, so it's not really seen that well. And these will tie it in there, like so. And go face towards the. Let me show you what I'm dealing with currently. All right, so here is the brass fitting that I have on there, and it goes around to here. So I'm just going to be replacing this piece, which has been there for for years. It's just piping I got from the hardware store. I'll replace this with this and this this tube will face this way and I'll just run it along here and it'll jump from here to here to get back over there. I'll replace this fitting with a, um, a stainless and then move on from there so I mean, that'll probably work. Won't be bad bad. And that's where I'm sitting. So, 